Hello, my name is Miss McHugh and I'm the Head of Sixth Form here at Cardinal Newman School. I always count myself lucky to be Head of Sixth Form. It is a real privilege to work with such a group of talented and enthusiastic young people. Every year students achieve amazing things, fulfilling their potential both academically and personally. This success is achieved because of our team of outstanding teachers who work with our students to motivate and enthuse them. They are real subject experts who are passionate and love working with students. Together with our highly committed support staff, they will always go the extra mile to support and guide our students. Students at Cardinal Newman enjoy their own sixth form centre, comprising of a spacious common room with fully equipped kitchen and designated sixth form lecture theatre. In the lecture theatre, computers are available alongside workspaces for individual and group study. Sixth form students also have the privilege um, or privilege access to the library and have their own separate, well resourced post 16 section. Students are also able to borrow laptops for use during the day. Now, in terms of structure of the day, uh, year 12 students will be in full time. All students will have chosen three A-level subjects to study and each one of those subjects will have five hours of timetabled lessons each week. So, for example, a student who chose business studies this year, they will have three hours of business on a Thursday, so periods one to three, and then two hours of business on a Monday afternoon, periods four and five. So, in total, you will have 15 hours of timetabled lessons per week. This means that during the week, you will have 10 hours where you will be timetabled in the lecture theatre or library for study periods. As a sixth form student, you will also have the privilege to leave the school site at break and lunch. We also have exclusive access to the upstairs of our canteen. As a sixth form student, you will be encouraged to develop as an independent learner and researcher. You will be responsible for taking your own notes carrying out research and managing your private study time of 10 hours per week. Your tutor and subject teachers will be guiding you on how to study, techniques you can use to ensure your time is used effectively, which gives you more free time outside of school. Your tutor will be a very important figure in your life at Cardinal Newman. You will have regular tutorials and one-to-one -one sessions where they'll help you to set targets and monitor your progress talking through any academic or personal issues. Additional support is also available from our specialist sixth form team. Some of the topics that you'll be covering in your tutor sessions are researching courses, universities, apprenticeships, and alongside that will come employability skills in terms of how to write a CV, a covering letter, um, budgets for universities, so how to actually get by on a student budget, um, student finance, how to apply for it, how it works, and healthy eating on a budget. Um, that is just to name a few. When you join Cardinal Newman, you're automatically become a member of our student union. This is run entirely by students, the senior student leadership team. They organise social events for you right throughout the year. On a more serious note, they also represent you at meetings with the head teacher and other staff so your views get heard by the people with the power to change things. The student leadership team also organises our big student events such as sixth form parties, dress down good days, big breakfasts, charity events, yearbooks, year hoodies um, and the prom. The student leadership team, um, the roles that you can start applying for in year 12 will be head boy, head girl, deputy head boy, head girl, uh, chaplaincy and Catholic life lead, um, culture lead, more able, social lead, student ambassador. So there are loads and loads of opportunities that you can get involved from within year 12. Our enrichment programme is at flagship standard. We offer excellent opportunities for you to try new things and develop interests and skills. You can also take part in a wide range of university summer schools, undertake work experience placements, compete in a variety of public speaking and subject based competitions. You can also support the school's chaplaincy team or take part in a wide range of charity and fundraising events. In the past, many of our students successfully undertook the Duke of Edinburgh Award. 
Some successful programmes have been the Pathways to Law, Banking and Finance and Engineering through the University of Warwick and the Sitting Trust. These programmes give students the opportunities to apply for work experience within those sectors. So, for example, from law, they were also able to hear from solicitors and barristers to better understand the jobs in the legal sector and to attend law lectures to see what university study involves. Two students who left um, in year 13 last year, so started university, through the completion of the banking and finance programme, they have now secured jobs with PricewaterhouseCoopers after they have um, finished their university three-year course. Another example is Medic Mentor. Um, so these are offered in medicine, veterinary science and dentistry. And these allow students um, to participate in work experience over six months. So they can demonstrate a commitment to learning about life as a doctor or a dentist or, a vet or in veterinary science. Um, they follow a number of patient journeys through primary, secondary and tertiary care. Now, this is just to name a few examples of what opportunities um, we make available for our students. Please listen to the next slide where you can hear from our own students in year 13 of all the different programmes that they participated in and what they have got out of it. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Aman Ali and I'm here today to talk to you about the programmes available for you as a sixth form student. The first programme is called HG Plus, provided by Cambridge. This is for those students aiming to get A's and A stars at A level and receive high academic success but may come from an underrepresented area. Some of the advantages of this programme are you can create a project called HG Plus by yourself or with a group, you can help your personal statement writing and you can get webinars on different subject areas and how they would be at university. The second programme is called Pathways to Banking and Finance. This is for those students aiming to get insight into the industry, learn more about it, and you can do this by speaking to professionals. I spoke to people from Lloyds, HSBC, NatWest, and you can get work experience from these industries. Warwick do this for both law, engineering, and obviously banking and finance. The final program is called Warwick Scholars. This is for those students who attend or want to study at Warwick. There are a full list of requirements which you must meet and you can check this on their website. The advantages are you can get a standard offer of two to four grades lower than the offer that you would normally be given at university. Another advantage is you can get up to £2,000 of tuition fee depending on your parents salary. Thank you for listening and I hope all of this has shown all the opportunities available for you as a sixth form student. Hello, my name is Anne Daffa and I participated in the Social Mobility Foundation. This gave me an insight into the life of a medical student as I was assigned a mentor. He gave me a lot of support within my personal statement, UCAS application and applying strategically. I also attended HE+. This gave me a lot of problem solving skills and essay writing skills as I was able to create a research poster of a topic of my choice. In addition, I also did realising opportunities. This gives you grade reductions, which can significantly help you in choosing your options for university. Hi, my name is Caelan Corkery and I'm a Year 13 student. I'm currently studying English Literature, History and Maths, and I'm just here today to talk to you a little bit about the opportunities that I've took part in since joining Sixth Form. Firstly, I participated in the Sutton Trust America programme, which I'm still a member of now. Um, in non-COVID years, they were able to visit America and see different parts such as New York and Boston, but unfortunately because of COVID, ours was online. However, this was still a really exciting residential where I got to visit loads of colleges and see if a liberal arts degree would be for me. I am considering applying for America alongside UCAS, which I'm really excited about because you can explore all different areas of study rather than solely one. Alongside this, I have also took part in a few law extracurriculars, for example, I applied and was successful in the Social Mobility Foundation Law Pathway, where I've been partnered with a barrister specialised in family law and have had one-on-one -on -one conversations with him about my career desires, alongside my personal statement and giving me feedback on that. Um, and yeah, and I've also done future learn courses independently, which I would really recommend. Um, for example, I did one led by Harvard University in contract law, which was just really exciting, especially if it's a new subject, which I have never done before. So yeah, thank you for taking the time to listen to me. 
Hi guys, my name is Kitty and I'm in year 13. I want to study medicine in university and I've taken up some opportunities to achieve this. I've joined many programmes such as Intermed School, where you are provided with a mentor who helps and guides you throughout your medical journey. Another programme I've joined is Access Leicester. Access Leicester is a medical programme for the University of Leicester, but if you successfully complete it, you get a guaranteed interview and a reduced offer up to two grades. This could go from AAA to ABB. I've also done some virtual work experience, such as Medic Mentor, where you watch and observe different situations in a hospital and see how different skills are required to successfully help the patient. In sixth form, there's lots of opportunities for us students to gain valuable work experience. Hello, my name is Molly, a Year 13 student studying English, History and Science. My goal is to become a qualified paramedic one day and to help vulnerable people in our community. During my time in lockdown, I was fortunate enough to sign up to a programme called the Allied Healthcare Mentor. This took place once a month on a Sunday. This programme was an incredible opportunity to open my eyes to various careers in the healthcare sector, including paramedic science, solidifying that this is the career for me. For example, I was highly fascinated in looking at real life scenarios that paramedics would face daily, but also being able to give the opportunity to ask them any questions that I may have. Overall, this programme was an outstanding learning experience and confirmed paramedic science is the future career path for me. Hello, my name is Liam Lidda. I'm currently a Year 13 study, um, student studying Sociology, English Literature and Business. And I successfully managed to get onto the Realising Opportunities programme hosted by Warwick University. And within the programme, you get to learn a lot about the day-to-day -day reality of a university student, um, practice lectures. So I got into the Door programme. So I got the real reality of what a law student goes through at Warwick University especially. And if I successfully complete the programme, I get reduced offers to over 20 universities. So if you need AAA for your original grades, I only need to get ABB. And also within the programme, you learn a lot about plagiarism, referencing, and the importance of doing your own work within the university. Hi, my name's Daniel Stromidlow, and I'm currently in year 13, studying maths, further maths, business and economics. Uh, so recently, I got onto the unique summer school where I uh, learned about how to get into Oxbridge. It helped uh, with admissions tests, interviews, and it, usually you spend a week in Oxford, uh, but sadly it was online, so I spent a week listening to lectures and professionals talk about the subject. My name is Emily and I took part in the Pathways to Bank and Finance with Warwick University. I thought this was a really good experience to find out what the banking world would be like and if that was something I'd like to go into. And we also had a like, work experience week where we got to speak to people who worked at Deutsche Bank and they told us about like their job, their day-to-day -day lives and kind of see if it was something that I could see myself doing. Um, so yeah, I thought it was really interesting and um, also on the course we had like meetings with everybody else on the course and we got to know each other better and talk to other people who had done the course as well and just how big of an impact it kind of made and how useful it actually is. So I would really, really recommend this course because it's just a great way for you to find out if a certain career is something that you actually want to do and you'd actually be interested in doing. So yeah, I really enjoyed my experience. Hi, I'm Sarah and I'm a year 13 student currently studying maths, physics and biology. Next day I hope to study aerospace engineering at university. To help me get where I need to be, I have enrolled in Social Mobility Foundation and they have helped me to develop the key skills I need to become an aerospace engineer. For example, I have been given a mentor who has supported me with my UCAT applications and also given me an insight into university and work life. I've also been able to I've also been able to attend webinars such as University Insight Lectures at Oxford and Cambridge. I've also been fortunate enough to gain work experience at HS2 Limited and Arab. Also the SMF, I've been able to gain mechanical engineering work experience at Siemens through Springboard, where I was able to develop my problem solving and reasoning skills. I have also taken part in summer programmes such as Discover Bath, which is a summer school where I was able to visit the University of Bath and meet lots of students. Hi, my name is Eloise and I have participated in the Warwick Pathways to Engineering and HU Plus programme. Both of these programmes have allowed me to develop key skills such as problem solving, teamwork and creative thinking, while also supporting my UCAT. They have also given me an insight into the engineering industry and furthered my want to study physics in university. 
So my name is Tasiga and I'm currently in year 13 studying English Literature, Sociology and Health and Social Care. Um, I was able to apply to a programme called Social Mobility Foundation, which I'm currently on. And this has given me a lot of insight into like university life and the societies in university and the ways in which um, I was able to gain support on my personal statement and how to make uh, myself stand out from other applicants. I specifically applied um under the business sector um on this program and this gave me a chance to talk to like a lot of employees and businesses about the courses they chose in university and just some of their time um and the careers that they're generally doing now and this program has genuinely helped me a lot during my time in sixth form so i'd recommend you all to apply for this program thank you